I'm starting off with a two foot by four foot piece of quarter inch MDF, and right now these cost me about $15. First I'll split the sheet into two pieces so that they fit on the CNC table. This is my Onefinity CNC. This is the woodworker model, and I've had it for a couple of years now, and it's been a great machine. I highly recommend it. The bit I'm using is a 1 16th inch down cut spiral. I've got a uh, two pack of these on Amazon for about $35 and they've worked really well on these signs. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to check them out. I'll place the larger piece on the CNC first and I already have some marks on the spoil board so that I can line these pieces up where I want them. I'll add a few hold downs and then I'll let the machine get to work. I can get three signs out of the larger board. I'm running the grouter at about 18,000 RPM and I'm cutting at 110 inches per minute. Next I'll put the smaller board on and position the lower left corner in the same spot as the larger board so that I don't have to reset the X and Y axis. I'll get two more signs out of this piece. With the cutting done, I'll give the back a quick sanding to knock off any fuzzy edge left from the bit. And then I'll cut the tabs with a knife. Finally, I'll use a flush trim bit on the router to remove the tab material from each piece. And that's it. Each of these sells for $25. For this run, I made 10 signs out of two pieces of MBF. So that's $30 in material that results in $250 in signs. Over the course of the last few years, we've probably made close to 300 of these signs. These signs, along with a couple other items, have paid for this machine at least three or four times. Well, that's it for this one. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you'll hit that like button. And don't forget to get subscribed so you don't miss any future videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next project.